Hey guys, it's me and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today in this video, I'm going to be becoming that girl for a day. This type of lifestyle has become such a huge trend at the moment, so I wanted to try out and give my personal opinion on it. Enjoy! I just woke up. It's 8 o'clock and my alarm just went off. Yeah. I'm gonna be trying to be that girl for the day. And if you don't know what that girl is, literally everyone's doing a YouTube video on it at the moment. I've seen my friend Emma do it and I've seen Erica Diane do it. I've seen loads of people do it and I wanted to hop on the trend. And that girl is basically kind of a lifestyle that's really organized, aesthetic, quite productive. And everyone has like different opinions on it. People think it's like, really intense and it's like too much to do it on an everyday basis and some people think it's really really good i don't know why this is such a popular thing in the that girl like lifestyle i guess every video i've seen of people being like that girl for the day they get lemon water and i think it's because it's really good for you apparently it's really refreshing in the morning never had lemon water because personally i only like like water on its own because whenever i have like fruit and water i just don't like the taste of it at all you know what lemon water does sound good this morning we've got no lemons It's okay. I know loads of people who really like it though. I think it's just me, so I definitely recommend trying it and getting your opinion. I just don't really like fruits in water, but it is really refreshing. So I get why people like it. So the next thing I'm gonna do is I have recently made a YouTube book. Well, I haven't made it. I got like a book, which I use for my YouTube channel. And I've started writing video ideas in it. And to be like productive and organized, I'm going to write my August videos in it and just some video ideas so I can like kind of choose out of them and then not come to the day I film and like not know what I'm filming. I think it's actually quite cute. So I've wrote some video ideas down, I've actually got quite a few down, which is really, really good. I probably wouldn't have done this if it wasn't for the video. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to pull my bed in, so I need space in my room. I pull my bed out because it's so much comfier, but my room has no space, like my room is just a bed. I'll show you. <laughs> just my bed. My room is now clean and ready for the day. I definitely say my room is quite aesthetic. Aesthetic room, so I do think it's a good fit for this video. There's a lot of self-care included in this kind of routine. I'm gonna use my Sorry Foaming Cleanser. I'm just going to use this roller. Then I'm going to take the CeraVe Eye Repair Cream. I do love this. I do use this quite a lot. I'm fine. I'm going with the coconut oil formula lip balm. This one is my favourite lip balm because it's like an oily substance. So it's like a lip oil. So I am now downstairs and I'm going to make my breakfast. So for breakfast, I want to try this new trend that I've seen. It's like really popular at the moment and it's where you make like Nutella porridge or like Nutella oats and like it's normally baked oats but you can also make porridge version. And I feel like this is a really that girl thing to do because it's kind of like a healthier option of a really like sweet breakfast. And I feel like hopping on a trend is something that they do too. So 
So I'm going to try this now. It actually looks really, really good. And I'm going to sit in the conservatory because I feel like that's a really aesthetic place to sit. Mmm. It's really good, but it's super filling. I still really recommend it. I just wouldn't make as much next time. Okay, I'm back upstairs and now I'm going to get ready for the day, aesthetic style. So I'm gonna be doing really like aesthetic-y makeup, which is like really light makeup, but like probably quite like glowy and shimmery because that's the vibes it gives off to me, to be honest. Okay, so I'm gonna do my makeup. So that's my natural makeup for the day. Now on to my outfit of the day. So annoyingly, the next part of the video has no audio. I've got to admit, I did accidentally drop the camera before filming this part. So I'm guessing that has something to do with it, but it did get fixed. But yeah, sorry about that. Next up, I'm going to make a healthy lunch to eat at the beach. So for quite a few parts in this video, it has no audio, but the rest of it does have audio when it gets to the end, but just bear with me. I will make it a good video still, don't worry. I'm letting you know that we're heading to the beach now to eat our salad there. So let's go to the beach. Okay, so we are now home. We got home about half an hour ago from the beach and I'm super excited because my mum just surprised me that we're gonna go to a nail salon and I'm gonna get acrylics done on my nails. So there was a cancellation on a local nail salon and I've been wanting to get my nails done for a while now because number one, it's my birthday in like a week. My birthday is on the 24th. I'm gonna get my nails done today and I feel like that's such a that girl thing to do as well, like really aesthetic. Okay, so I'm back from the nail salon and I'm so happy with my nails. It looks so pretty. I got a bluey grey colour. I think it's such a gorgeous colour. So yeah, these are my nails. So we're about to have dinner. Before we do, I want to fit in a workout. I've started this workout app, which is really, really good. And then it will be a 30 day one. To be honest, I've missed a few days, so I need to catch up on probably two days, but it's getting harder. So we'll see how this goes, and especially when it's hot. It's like a full body kind of one. I actually started to have stomach in the beginning, but it actually does your whole body. It's the 30 day workout flat stomach. If you want to do it, this is what it is. But I'm going to do this now. We've done the workout. It was tiring, but it wasn't unbearable. So, workout done. So, I had dinner and it's a little bit later now. I'm kind of getting ready for bed now, but the first thing I'm going to do is take my makeup off. So, I'm going to do some self care as the last part of my video, and I'll just head to bed. As I said this morning, having like self care and pampering type things is definitely a that girl thing to do. And obviously, it's quite aesthetic when you do like face masks and stuff. I'm just going to start off by taking a makeup pad and the Fine Flowers Milk. <laughs> This is definitely the best like makeup remover I have found for myself because it's not too oily, like micellar waters for me. But this is like a milk, like not an actual milk, but it's more like a moisturizer substance. It removes makeup, cleanses and nourishes, which is not really like specifically got a job on your face. So you can use it for loads of things. I recommend it. When this video is up, it'll be eight days before my birthday. I'm counting down the days, guys. I'm honestly so excited.
makeup is now off and I'm not gonna do some skincare. I just tend to do more skincare at night, I don't know why, but like in the morning, I'm not in for skincare that much. The first thing I'm going to use is these little under eye whales. There's like quite a lot of opinions on the way you put these on. Like some people say you should put it on with a little bit at the front, and some people say you should put it on like the other way around. For me, I put it on like this, just cause personally, it fits best on my face. If there's a certain way, then make sure to tell me in the comments. And I'm just gonna keep these on for a while. So while I'm doing that, I'm just gonna like do stuff on the rest of my face. So I'm gonna put a little face mask on. I haven't done a face mask in a while, but this is the L'Oreal Pure Clay Glow Mask. It's a little pink color. I don't use this brush anymore. So I'm gonna go straight in with it. I apologize, this is an eyeshadow brush. You know what, it works really well. You girls gotta do what you girls gotta do. This is the face mask all on. I actually love this face mask. Like most face masks, there's certain face masks, which I'm saying face mask way too much. It's too late. It's too late. It's almost 10 o'clock at night. Oh my gosh, my skin feels amazing. I like can't even explain how good this face mask is. If there's any face mask I'm ever gonna recommend to anyone, it is this one. Honestly, it makes my skin feel so smooth. If I ever use moisturizer, I won't use a lot of it. Moisturizer, I used to love it. It was like literally my biggest fan, but now it's just not my favorite. Now I'm going in with my CeraVe Eye Repair Cream. Finally, I'm going in with the Coconut Oil Formula Palmer's Coconut Oil Lip Balm. It's just a really oily substance, so it feels like a lip oil and it's like not sticky at all. It's just like a really nice thing for my lips. That is my skincare done. Lovely job left. So that is the end of my video. I really hope you enjoyed me trying to be that girl for the day. Personally for me, I would not do this every day. It seems like something that would be a really nice self-care day and a really nice productive day. And I get why people say it's just too much to do every day. There is days that you need to be relaxed. But that is my overall opinion on this lifestyle and trend at the moment. This is my shout out for this week's video. Thank you for being really active on my page and for commenting on my videos. It's now my videos and not on my community page photos. Thank you for watching my video. I'll see you all next week on Friday. Bye!